Hey guys, it's Topsy Thursday. That's right. I didn't do this on Tuesday. Sorry, I was just not feeling the makeup for the past couple days. <laughs> kind of just wanted to give my face rest. And so I decided to just do it this Thursday. This week I'm doing my top five blushes. Now I no, I said in a previous video that I had my top five blushes a couple weeks ago. Completely forgot to do blush. I don't know why I forgot to do blush. I love blush. It's 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 a make it's another make or break. Like I said last week with highlight, like blush is a make or break for a look. I mean lips, yeah, but I think if you put too much blush on train wreck if you don't put enough blush on blush so that's kind of my little thing so I love blush remember these are my top five blushes they might not be yours um, but these are my top five so again these are ones that I like to use for myself sometimes I use stuff that I like to use on others but usually it's stuff I like to use on myself so just remember that okay so the first one I have, let's do high end first this week. I have, my first one is MAC. It's the color that I said that I liked in the top five a couple weeks ago, even though I didn't like it in my top five. It's the color Stubborn. It's this color right here. It's a nice, deep, I want to say purpley mauve color. Um, really really nice on dark skin tones again if you have fair fair skin this might look a little much you can try it but yeah it'll be a little much but I love this one and this I got during the Moody Blooms collection even though I think this is permanent no this is permanent this isn't the one I got but I do love this one the next one is also a high-end one and it is the Tarte Amazonian Blush in Inspired. And I like this. It's a very um, palish pink. What I love about these, like their claim, they do last a very, very, very long time. Because usually with makeup, one of the first things to go is your blush. Um, so usually because of pores and everything like that. But... This is one of the first things to go, and I do love this one. It lasts a very, very long time. There is some shimmer in it, but not enough, not too much shimmer that it is distracting. So, love that one. Okay, the next are all drugstore. If you've been watching my channel, you realize that I really love drugstore stuff. I just, I don't know if it's because it's cheaper or it's just because it's a little more accessible, I guess you could say. Um, the first one is the Master Highlight in the color da, 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 Mauve, or Mauve, some people are very technical. It's a very shimmery highlight, it's kind of like a bronze color, if you want to use it as a bronzer, it's a nice bronzer for deep toned skin, um, even though there is a little bit of a highlight in there, so you want to be a little careful where you place your brush. This is great because if you don't want to use a highlight, this has a highlight built into it. It's just a really nice glow on the cheeks. The next one is from e.l.f. and it's in the color Coral, Candid Coral. And it's a nice peach color. I like using this with a red lip or uh, just a different kind of look because it's kind of a, a new, new blech. It's a neutral shade, so it comes across not too. Because if you wear, let me let me say, if you if you're wearing a red lip, the last thing you want to wear is something this deep because it's just gonna look a little crazy. But so this is just nice for a nice dark eye or dark lip. This blush goes really well with it. If that makes any sense. And this is from Elf, so this is like three dollars. You can get this at Target. I got this, I think, at the Elf store in New York City, but. You can order it online, and the best time to go online is when they have their 50% off, which is crazy. Okay, and the last one is probably one of my favorite blushes, and I have a lot of blushes by this company, and it's the Milani one, but this one's my favorite shade. Again, I have deeper skin tone, so 
again if you have light skin tone it might not look too too pretty but luminoso i'm sure you've heard of it it's all over youtube it's it's a gorgeous gorgeous fair tone skin of gorgeous fair down blush um, but this is the color red vino and this is just my if i'm going for a dramatic night look this is my favorite i'll just swatch it because yeah it's just it's a, a brick orange color it's shimmery but it's pretty but again when we, let me just buff it out a little bit see it's not too drastic it's just it's very nice on this skin it, oh it's so pretty but again if you're doing this you don't want to do it with like a nude lip would look really really bad anyway so those are my top five blushes i would love to hear yes i do for some of you who are like how do you know have nars orgasm in your favorite i do like nars orgasm but for me it just doesn't look as pretty as it would on somebody else so again these are my top five so all you makeup people out there don't go nuts i do like it it's just not for me all right so thanks girls bye